to Newfoundland this summer. So we drove, obviously, if you've been following us, we drove from Prince George to Nova Scotia, then we stopped there for three weeks, and then we drove to Newfoundland and went as far as St. John's. In Newfoundland we had a great time. Yeah. Lots of food. Yes, Dominic's dad is an excellent cook. And his cousin, or his, sorry, Martin's cousin Brendan, Dominic's nephew, caught fish. Caught fish or halibut? He caught codfish and Dominic's dad made us fish and chips and it was unbelievable. Martin's just waking up back there. Hey buddy. Um, it was really nice to have um, Dominic's family around. In my, well, it's nice to have all of our family around, obviously. But uh, in my family, Martin, his cousins are similar in age, they're younger. And so he just kind of gets swept up and he's like a part of the gang, which is also amazing on its own. And then in Newfoundland, where everyone is older, he just is like a superstar and just everyone's fighting over them and everyone's so nice to him and babysitting and he just has so much fun. So that was also really awesome. Um, we went to St. John's a few times. St. John's is a really beautiful city. That's the capital of Newfoundland. All right, so we're back in Newfoundland and St. John's is a very beautiful city. How do you feel being back in Newfoundland? Good. Like I never left. Yes. How are the streets of St. John's for driving? Oh, they're quality or what? <laughs> uh, just how is the ease of driving? When you arrive to an intersection, if you were not from St. John's, <laughs> Good luck. do you know where to go immediately? I'm used to it, so it's not bad, but I can't imagine how tourists come up on us and just know what to do. It's it's, it's, it's an old city. It is. It is. Yeah, it's nice though. It's a beautiful city and a lot of the buildings are getting redone and like they're, you know, making apartments and stuff downtown and everything looks really cool. Everything's so colorful. It's nice being here in the summertime. Yeah. I like it a lot. But yeah, St. John's. But we did go to Mallard Cottage, which is a really nice restaurant in Kitty Vitty. That is a, a little fishing village in St. John's. And Mallard Cottage is amazing. It's a renovated old cottage. And the, the silverware is from like the CN trains. I don't know how they got it, but like it's like antique silverware. And we went for lunch and they use a lot of local food. And it's just amazing. It's really good. Yeah, it's not too pricey either for like higher end food. Yeah, it was. Not that we had to pay for it. <laughs> Thank you. Our mm. um, but it was really nice. And then you can buy a box at the end for like pastries. There's like a $10 box and a $15 box. And you, there's a big pastry table with just stuff that's made from their in-house pastry chef. And you can fill up the box as much as you want. Like, you don't close it or anything. And that's why I filled it up a lot. Like was my best Tetris move ever. And then I took cupcakes and just put cupcakes on the top and then I gave it to Dominic's brother Martin to carry out because I was too embarrassed. So I was like, there's no way they're gonna give me this. Not that they would stop me, obviously, but it was amazing. And then we had so much, it was just like, it was enough to do for about a week of sweets with tea and it lasted 25 minutes in the car on the way back to Babel's. Yeah. But, and we stayed in Babel's because that's where Dominic grew up. We stayed with his parents. And stuff to do around there it's really beautiful the humpback whales are there first of all which is really amazing we were there in August so the whales the whale season's better in July but I think we did still see some just like from the shore we didn't go on a tour or anything it just seemed like there was none compared to last year oh well, last year the year before it was not like this normally but there were so many whales in the harbor that you'd look out at any given time and there'd be like dozens like I'm not even exaggerating and it's not they're all pretty close in and you're just looking out and just seeing just a bunch of humpback whales. It's absolutely incredible. Um, but yeah, it wasn't like that this year, but it was still really nice. We hiked to the lighthouse, which is a part of the East Coast Trail hike um, called the Spout, where you can hike to a freshwater spout. 
It's kind of driven by the waves, I guess. I guess it's a freshwater and saltwater. There's a river that runs down through a crack to the ocean, and the waves coming in kind of put a lot of pressure on it and shoot it back up, and it shoots up through the rocks like you guys are. Makes a big giant cone of ice around it in the winter and stuff. Yeah, it's really nice. Um, but we didn't hike there. We hiked to the lighthouse, which is a lot closer, and it was really beautiful. just kind of a recap of what we did in Newfoundland and it was really nice. It was basically just to be there for friends and family. A lot of Dominic's childhood friends were home at the same time which is really nice. Ed, Jared, who else was there? Ed, Jared and Sean were all home at the same time. Ed, Jared and Sean were all home at the same time. So he got to see everybody. They got to play their really long board game. Hmm. Dominic would leave for like hours and hours at night <laughs> playing, what was it, like six hours? game of Twilight Imperium, so we got to do that, which was nice, and... It was, uh, shout, well, shout out to Mom and Rosemary, who <laughs> did a lot of babysitting for us, so we could hang out with our friends, and go to the gym, and do stuff, Yeah. just the two of us sometimes, so... That's really nice. We even went out to dinner, we got sushi. Yeah, was that was, like, awesome. the that was only... Birthday. Yeah. That was really nice. That was really nice. We went out one time since Marvin was born, to a restaurant together alone and that was this summer and it was very lovely and I still appreciate it. <laughs> we love hanging out with Martin and taking him to restaurants too. It's just, it's nice to get away. But uh, yeah, thanks everybody in Newfoundland. We had such a good time. Bye.
Where are you going, buddy? 